to my channel, Be The Source. My name is Bianca. If you're new here, welcome. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and that notification bell to know when I post new videos. And as you can tell, I am sporting a new hairdo. I decided to cut my hair. I've never really been a big fan of short hair, but I was like, you know what? I've never really had short hair. No one's really seen me with short hair. Might as well do it. It's still an adjustment for me. I don't know if I necessarily like it yet, but it's an adjustment. Well, I'll grow to love it. Anyways, this video is going to focus on some top essentials I think every girl should have in their closet for summer. It's super hot, especially in New York. It's humid. So I'm going to give you some essentials that you should have. And also it's going to be a mini haul because I got some new things behind me that I wanted to try on for you guys. And it covers all the things that I think every girl should have in their closet. So let's get into the video. Okay, starting off with tank tops. I think tank tops are super essential to have in your closet, especially for summertime. I think every girl should have at least two tank tops in their closet, at least two. I think girls have a lot more, but at least a black one, like the one that I'm wearing right now, and a beige one. These are two colors that go with everything, so it's a great staple to have in your closet. I got these from Misguided. Super comfortable. I love the square neck of it. You can get any style of tank tops, but yes, tank tops are super important to have in your closet for summer. This corset top also from Misguided. It's also a tank top. It's cropped. I love it. I love the shape of it. I love the way it fits on me. It makes me feel like I should be on the island of Barbados or Jamaica or something. Sipping, you know, a virgin pina colada or whatever it is that people drink. But yeah, love this top. Very bright, vibrant colors, which is also good for summertime. I love this top from Windsor. I haven't shopped at Windsor for a while, but I saw this fashion blogger on Instagram that I follow. Most of the clothes that she wears is from Windsor. So I'm like, let me check it out. So it's kind of like, you can't really see, but as you can see it on me, I love the square neck of it, spaghetti strap. Spaghetti strap tops are also super important because honestly, I would say summer like less is more, but in a modest way, because don't go quoting me saying Bianca asked you to look, look like you know. <laughs> Less is more in a modest way because it's hot, it's humid, especially in New York, it's humid and the heat just sits there. It's so annoying, but love the way this fits. My favorite part of this shirt is the back of it. The back is crisscross. It's super cute. Love that for summer as well. You can pair it with a skirt, you can pair it with jeans, whatever you want. This top I got from Misguided, I just got it because I thought it was cute and I really like this, the puffy sleeves of it. It's a crop top, also great for summer. You can pair it with some jeans, some nice fitted pants. It's a very dressy top, so I wouldn't necessarily want to dress it down. But if you do want to dress it down, you can wear sneakers with high-waisted jeans. Light, I would say light colored jeans. You can pair it with this. Now moving away from tank tops, we're gonna go into dresses. The types of dresses that I think are really essential that every girl should have in their closet, starting with off the shoulder. This dress I got from Winter as well, super comfortable. It's a linen dress, I love it. I don't really have that much white in my closet, so I was like, okay, let me get this dress and see how it fits. I love how girly it is, the ruffles on the sleeves. This dress is super comfortable. The detailing of it is really nice. Off the shoulder dresses are super important because it's just fun, it's girly. It's also a trend for summertime. Another off the shoulder dress that I got is this pink gingham dress. I saw this dress and I was like, hmm, I don't know if I would like this. Pink is my favorite color, but I don't wear it a lot. So when I saw this dress, I was like, I'm going out on a limb. I love how girly this dress is. I feel like such a girl's girl in this dress. I love the way it hugs my body. It's so cute. It's also off the shoulder, which I love. I got this dress from Winter. Oh, to, just to mention, that pink gingham dress is also from Misguided. This dress is from Winter. Super cute, you can wear it on the shoulders or you can wear it off the shoulders, so it's like a dual dress. I really like it, it fits really nice. You can dress it up or dress it down, but it's more on the formal side. Moving on, another style of dress that every girl should have in their closet are slip dresses. Specifically for me, my favorite are slip dresses with a cowl neck. Love this, this is from Nasty Gal. Super comfortable, cute. This is a dress that you can wear 
with sneakers, you can wear it with heels. It's a good versatile dress that you can slip on for any, almost any occasion. And I think everyone should have this in their closet. The material, I think is satin, I believe, but every girl should have at least, again, two slip dresses in their closet. It could be, it doesn't really matter what color, but I always... I hate it here. It doesn't really matter what color it is, but I like to wear black a lot because black goes with everything and it's also very slimming. So yeah, another dress, which I also got from Misguided. This is another style dress, polka dot with the cowl neck. I love it. I probably with most of the cowl neck slip dresses, I would wear it with sneakers, kind of like these sneakers. Surprisingly, I really like them. They're very light, very comfortable, but my only thing when breaking them in is the heel part of it is super uncomfortable. The material of the shoe was rubbing against my heel and it broke skin. Sorry, a little bit TMI, but just warning if you want to buy. I think that happens with like almost every shoe you wear, but it was so uncomfortable, so that's a warning. This specific black dress is a little bit more formal and I saw it on the website and I'm like, I like it, I'm gonna get it. Super cute, I love the straps of it and the bows on top fits me really well this is more of a formal dress so if you're going out to dinner or something like that it's a good essential to have in your closet as well next item that a girl should have in their closet for summertime are skirts i'm going to show you one skirt because this is also a mini haul but satin skirt kind of like this super cute got this from winter love the way it fits on me it's flowy it's cute it's easy you can dress it up dress it down with this particular skirt i paired it with the strappy top from winter um you could do something like that and then i paired it with these sandals sandal heels from nasty gal which i also when it comes to shoes sneakers sandals heeled sandals those are essentials that you should have in your closet because it gives you two types of look. If you're trying to dress it up, wear your heels. If you're trying to dress it down, wear some sneakers. Skirts are super important. You should have at least two in your closet, I would say. Honestly, two of everything in either black or white. Yes, that's it for skirts. Now moving on to jeans and shorts. Now. I'm not really a shorts girl, but I still have at least three pairs of shorts in my closet. And that is super essential for summertime because if you don't have shorts, you, who wants to wear jeans all day? Not everyone wants to wear jeans all day. So shorts, I got this from Nasty Gal. Really cute. It's a little big on me, which is fine, but I really like the fraying on the bottom and you can pair it with a tank top like the one that I'm wearing right now, the beige one that I'm wearing right now. Throw on some sneakers. Anything with sneakers during the summer is great because most of the time we're out and about with our friends and our family, walking around, going to the mall, walking on the beach or the boardwalk. Every girl should have at least three pairs of denim shorts in their closet. I feel like every girl does, unless your parents literally don't let you wear shorts at all. Which was my mom at a point, but you know, she's, she's changed. We'll have a light wash like this. These are from Guess. They're a little worn, but super cute. Pair up with tank tops, love it. Last but not least, jeans. Like the jeans that I have on right now, these are from Nasty Gal. I really like them. I personally still wear high-waisted mom jeans. These are a little big on me in the waist, which is fine, but I think everyone has at least three pairs of high-waisted mom jeans. Super essential to have in your closet. High-waisted is still on trend. People are still wearing it. Mom jeans are really nice because it hugs you in the waist and then it kind of like slims down. These are my favorite mom jeans. They're from Lee Jeans. You can wear them with a tank top or I'm wearing it with this island corset top just to show you like the, the full outfit. Love it, super cute. You need it in your closet. That concludes today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will link in the description below all of the items that were worn in today's video. Other than that, I hope you guys got something out of this, but don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys.